You also have a full-sized sex doll releasing this fall. What was the experience like getting molded for that? And what is the process? So yeah, it was an AVN this year. I um, met the people that are doing the sex doll and it's Iron Tech dolls. Um, the process first, you know, you have to discuss all the business aspects, like, you know, what it's going to cost, what you're getting paid, everything like that. Um, once that's all figured out, contract is signed. They had me go to three different like body scanning um, places because they needed like all these different very intricate body scans because this particular sex doll is supposed to be like a 99% identical replica to me. Um, it's supposed to be very advanced compared to some of the other companies out there. So um, we had to scan each body part separately from my fingers and nails to my feet to, you know, my lady parts, uh, my hair. They needed, you know, photos of everything as well, of the preferred makeup. Um, so, yeah, um, three different body scans, lots of like raw natural photos later. And they really wanted to perfect it. It was supposed to come out actually uh, a couple months ago, but, you know, they kind of were finalizing some details. But I just actually got word earlier this week that it is done. So in the next month or two, it will be available for purchase. Have you seen it yet? I have seen it. Like, I am shook. It looks just like me. Oh, my God. <laughs> Do you get to have a copy for yourself? Yeah. So they're actually sending me the first one. And so I'm like, where am I going to put this bitch oh my in God. my house? At the dinner and table? how odd. I'm, I'm going to scare myself with it yeah. because I don't at the dinner table and I like walk in one night like, ah! I just, I'm just thinking of all like the viral TikTok videos that you can do. Yeah, no, like, I have, I've also thought of that. I'm like, that would be such a rape Custom and custom. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put her up at my studio or my dungeon and like oh do God. sessions with her. Like Ugh. you don't even deserve to lick my feet. You're going to lick her feet. Oh my God. <laughs> the yes. the like spring of creativity that has come yeah, from this. Yeah, no, there's a lot of good ideas brewing to do with it, but it's exciting. It looks just like me, which is scary, but cool at the same time. Wow. Yeah. And then does it like, it probably has that really realistic feeling like It skin does. Like the and skin looks very realistic. Like the eyelashes, the hair. And then it's how insane. do you clean it? I don't know. I think like whenever you buy something, they send you like a manual on how you're supposed to clean it and take care of it for best use. But yeah, that's also, that's a really good question because I'm like, obviously there will be some uh, bodily made? fluids somewhere. <laughs> like, how are we getting those out of there? I think that there's a compartment yeah. to take that out. It's probably like it. the fleshlights where they like right. pull the sleeve yeah. out or something. No, I know. But yeah. I'm sure they've thought of it. <laughs> <laughs> I would I would hope so. I know that they have. <laughs> oh my god. 